Hello everyone, here's a question on parallelogram. The question is A, B, C, D is a parallelogram. This is A, B, C, D in which angle D, A, B that is D, A, B this angle A is 75 degree D, B, C that is D, B, C they're talking about this angle is 60 degree calculate angle C, D, B I'm going to mark this C, D, B is here C so it is C, D and B which means we're talking about this in this small angle we have to find out this angle and uh, let me mark with yellow we have to find out this angle A, D, B and we have to find out this two angles we have to find out here that is entire angle D we have to find out so how to do this now if you ob observe this parallelogram now they have given in parallelogram opposite sides are parallel right so this is parallel and this is parallel at side suppose and this is transversal and you know that interior opposite angles are equal so this angle and this angle is equal the interior opposite angle now if you see the parallelogram here DC and AB are parallel yes and AB with DB will become transversal same like this these two sides are parallel and DB suppose this line is transversal this is transversal if this angle is 60 then this angle that is ADB will also become 60 degree because they are parallel sides I'm just drawing here these two lines are parallel and this is transversal yes so this angle 60 and this angle are interior opposite angles and they will be equal so like the using this we can say angle ADB that is this angle we have to find out which will be equal to 60 degree so let me erase this I'm gonna use this uh, this property and I'm gonna find out the one angle here now since so So interior opposite angles are equal interior or we can say interior alternate angles are equal interior alternate angles are equal therefore angle a d b will be same as angle d b c and d b c angle is 60 degree so therefore we can say angle a d b will also be equal to 60 degree so we have found one angle which is 60 degree now we have to find out this angle that is c d a now there are many ways of finding out so one I, I'm gonna use here is uh, we know that adjacent angle sum is 180 degree we can use that or we can find out this angle C and using that using this triangle we're gonna find out this third angle we can use that I'm gonna go with uh, second method so we know that in parallelogram opposite angles are equal so in parallelogram now this is a short form of writing a parallelogram don't write this in your exams I'm just explaining here in parallelogram opposite angles are equal opposite angles are equal which means angle A will be equal to angle C and we know angle A since angle A is equal to 75 degree which means angle C will be also equal to 75 degree so we got angle C which is 75 so this angle C they have not asked but I am finding out because I have to find out this angle C D B this angle I have to find out right that's why now you can see that this D C B is forming a triangle in this triangle we know two angles so two angles we know using that we're going to find out this third angle okay so in triangle D C B sum of all angle is 180 so angle C D B plus angle D C D C B plus angle C B D will be equal to 180 degree I'm adding all the three angle so C D B we don't know we have to find out that so I'm going to write down C D B in the next step plus angle D C B 75 degree plus angle C B D 60 degree is equal to 180 degree so 75 plus 60 is 135 so angle C D B is equal to 180 I'm just doing in one step 
minus 135 when you add the 75 and 60 it is 135 and this 135 transposing in the transposing to the other side so this is plus sign when transposes to other side gonna be a sign will change it will be minus so 180 minus 135 when you do it you will get 45 so therefore we got one this angle which is 45 therefore angle C D B is equal to 45 degree so that's it I hope this question is clear in case you have further questions or doubts, you can drop a comment. Thank you so much for watching.